energy is a fundamental aspect of our existence that can neither be created nor destroyed, but can indeed be shaped and transformed. This principle is recognized by energy workers and some psychotherapists who believe you can tap into your energetic system and change the energy within you. If you ever feel sluggish or tired, it's possible to manipulate that stuck energy to flow freely, attracting positive vibrations like joy and peace. This video aims to enlighten you on how to control your energy, understand its flow, manipulate and redirect it, and restore depleted energy. Understanding how energy flows within and around you is the first step toward learning how to control it. Everything in the universe is made up of energy, including your thoughts, emotions and physical body. By becoming aware of how energy moves through your life, you can notice patterns that help or harm your well-being. To start, it's important to recognize that your energy levels are affected by both internal and external factors. Internally, your thoughts and emotions have a big impact. For example, if you're constantly thinking negative thoughts like, I'm not good enough, or I'll never succeed, this can block or stagnate your energy, making you feel tired and unmotivated. On the other hand, positive thoughts like, I can do this, or I am worthy, encourage a free flow of energy, boosting your mood and energy levels. Externally, things like your environment, relationships and daily activities can either drain or replenish your energy reserves. For instance, imagine you walk into a cluttered, messy room. You might feel overwhelmed and stressed, which drains your energy. But if you spend time in a clean, organized space, you likely feel more relaxed and energized. Similarly, Spending time with people who uplift and support you can boost your energy, while being around those who are negative or demanding can leave you feeling drained. To improve your energy flow, start by paying attention to your thoughts and emotions. When you notice negative thoughts creeping in, try to replace them with positive affirmations. For example, if you catch yourself thinking, I'm going to fail, change it to, I am capable and I can succeed. This shift in mindset can help keep your energy flowing smoothly. Next, look at your external environment and relationships. Create a space that feels peaceful and uplifting to you. This might mean decluttering your home, adding plants or artwork, or keeping things tidy. Surround yourself with people who support and encourage you, and try to limit time with those who drain your energy. To control your energy effectively, it is crucial to start with mindfulness. Practicing mindfulness helps you become more aware of your present state, allowing you to identify when and where energy imbalances occur. This awareness can be cultivated through meditation, deep breathing exercises, or taking a moment to pause and observe your thoughts and feelings. When you are mindful, you can sense when your energy is low or when it feels stuck. This awareness is the first step in addressing any imbalance. Once you become mindful of your energy, the next step is to manipulate and redirect it. One effective way to do this is through visualization techniques. Visualization involves imagining yourself in a state of balance and harmony. For instance, you can picture a bright, healing light flowing through your body, dissolving any blockages and revitalizing your entire being. This technique not only helps shift your focus away from negative thoughts, but also encourages a positive flow of energy throughout your body. Additionally, incorporating affirmations can reinforce this process. For example, start your day by looking in the mirror and saying, I am full of energy and vitality. Repeat it several times, really feeling the meaning of the words. This practice sets a positive tone for the day and helps you carry that energetic mindset with you. If you encounter a challenging situation, take a moment to repeat your affirmation, reminding yourself of your inner strength and positive energy. Visualization and affirmations work together to help you take control of your energy. Visualization creates a mental image of your desired state, while affirmations reinforce that image with powerful positive words. This combination can help you shift your energy away from negativity and towards a more balanced and harmonious state. Moreover, don't force yourself to control anything in life. 
Think about whether you're trying too hard to make something happen, because that can create blocks in your energy. For example, if you're trying very hard to make someone like you, you're creating a forcing current of energy. This forcing energy tells others and the universe that you're unhappy and unsatisfied, which is a lower, negative vibration. Instead of trying to force things, let life unfold naturally. When you relax and go with the flow, you attract people, positive experiences, and even miracles into your life. So, whenever you notice yourself forcing something, take a step back. Let go of the need to control everything, and trust that things will work out. This way, you keep your energy high and positive, making it easier to attract good things into your life. Relationships are another critical aspect to consider when controlling your energy. The people you interact with can significantly impact how you feel, either uplifting or depleting your energy. Being mindful of the individuals you surround yourself with is essential for maintaining a healthy and balanced energy flow. One effective way to safeguard your energy is by setting boundaries. Boundaries are limits you establish to protect your emotional and energetic health. For example, if you have a friend who frequently brings negativity into conversations, you might limit the amount of time you spend with them or steer the conversation towards more positive topics. By setting these boundaries, you ensure that you are not continually exposed to draining interactions. Learning to say no when necessary is also crucial for protecting your energy. It's okay to decline invitations or requests that you feel will negatively impact your well-being. For instance, if you're feeling particularly exhausted and a colleague asks you to take on an additional task, it's perfectly acceptable to say, I'm sorry, but I can't take on anything extra right now. Prioritizing your energy and well-being is essential for maintaining a balanced and healthy life. Consider cultivating relationships with people who inspire and support you. These individuals can help you grow, provide encouragement, and contribute positively to your energy. For example, joining a group or community that shares your interests and values can connect you with like-minded people who uplift and energize you. Additionally, spending quality time with loved ones who bring joy and positivity into your life can significantly boost your energy. Whether it's having a heartfelt conversation with a family member, laughing with friends, or enjoying a shared hobby. These interactions can recharge your energy and enhance your overall well-being. To restore depleted energy, it is essential to prioritize self-care. Engaging in activities that bring you joy and relaxation can replenish your energy reserves. This could include hobbies, spending time in nature, reading, listening to music, or taking a warm bath. Ensuring you get enough rest and quality sleep is also crucial. Sleep is a time for the body to repair and rejuvenate, and without adequate rest, your energy levels will suffer. Establishing a regular sleep routine and creating a restful sleep environment can significantly improve your energy levels. Finally, it is important to cultivate a positive mindset and attitude towards life. Positivity attracts positive energy, while negativity attracts negative energy. Practicing gratitude, focusing on your strengths, and maintaining an optimistic outlook can significantly influence your energy levels. When you focus on the good in your life and approach challenges with a positive attitude, you create an environment where positive energy can thrive. My friend, controlling your energy to achieve what you want in life involves a holistic approach that includes mindfulness, visualization, physical movement, a healthy diet, a positive environment, supportive relationships, self-care, and a positive mindset. Remember, energy is a powerful force that, when harnessed correctly, can help you achieve your greatest desires and lead a balanced, harmonious life. I hope you enjoyed watching my video. If you're still with me, please leave a comment saying, I am in control of my energy, guiding it towards my highest good. If you comment this affirmation, I'll give your comment a heart. As always, wishing you a beautiful day.